Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Toyota has just come up with a super eco-friendly way to apply paint on their vehicles using static electricity. So smash the like button and let's get into this one. Over at the global Toyota newsroom, Toyota develops a new paint atomizer with over 95% coating efficiency, which is by far the highest in the world. Toyota has developed a new paint atomizer that uses static electricity instead of air to replace the conventional air paint atomizers used in the vehicle body painting process. It achieves over 95% coating efficiency, which means the amount of paint sprayed versus the amount that actually adheres onto the vehicle body, which a conventional efficiency is around 60 to 70 percent. By using this process, it is expected Toyota can reduce its CO2 emissions by about 7 percent. In addition, the collection device situated at the bottom of the paint booth, the area where the paint is sprayed, can be made more compact. Therefore, it is able to make painting production lines much more compact for the future. With this technology, they're able to maximize their space inside their production lines now. So if painting vehicles was a bottleneck before, reduce the amount of space that you can either open up that space for other spots in their production line that maybe are reducing the efficiency if there are other bottlenecks, or this could allow them to paint more vehicles at once. So it just gives them a lot of flexibility in the production line. They've developed the airless paint atomizer and developed it at both the Takaoka plant and Tsutsu plan. Gradual deployment at other plants is planned as well as consideration of deployment among other Toyota Group companies and licensing the technology to other companies, right? They want to make that money licensing this out to every single automaker they possibly can. Let's dig into the features of this airless paint atomizer. So conventional air paint atomizers uh, spray paint primarily using aerodynamic force, then paint the vehicle body with atomized particles using an air paint atomizer. For this reason, paint particles are scattered by the air ricocheting off the vehicle body, resulting in coating efficiency of approximately 60 to 70 percent that we talked about earlier. By comparison, the new airless paint atomizer uses electricity to spray the paint and the statically charged particles coat it in such a way that they gravitate toward the vehicle body through electrostatic painting. The tip of the airless paint atomizer features a rotating cylindrical head that optimizes the amount of paint sprayed. Electrostatic atomization technology is used in beauty treatment devices and other instruments that spray fine amounts of liquid. Here, we applied it to the vehicle painting. Specifically, the tip of the paint sprayer is cylindrical. Approximately 600 special grooves are inserted into the tip, which is rotated to create a centrifugal force, inducing the paint to flow into the grooves and atomize through static electricity. And this way, we developed the world's first technology that paints vehicle bodies with atomized paint particles using static electricity. And it has highly accurate current control that makes close range painting possible. The unevenness of the body of the vehicle causes the distance between the cylindrical head and the vehicle body to fluctuate, making the electrical current unstable. However, the airless paint atomizer constantly monitors the variations in current and automatically controls the voltage, maintaining a distance of approximately 10 centimeters between the cylindrical head and the vehicle body. Hence, electrostatic atomization, electrostatic painting under a fixed current is rendered possible, in turn preventing variation in the size of the paint particles. The result is high quality painting. So this is some pretty cool technology. Toyota is always coming out with crazy new ways to improve their manufacturing process. And of course, we don't really think about the painting process that much, at least I don't. Now, are they gonna be able to use this on Lexus products as well? I don't know, maybe. Um, it depends if they're able to maintain the exact quality or make it even better with this electrostatic painting process. But to me, it seems like the future of automotive painting at the assembly lines, able to reduce the space in which it takes, able to reduce the amount of paint that they're spraying on the vehicles and able to reduce their CO2 emissions. Sounds like a win-win, win sort of situation uh, for this new technology and for Toyota. And the fact that they'll be able to license this out to other automakers means that this is a money maker for them, not only by 
making more efficient their assembly line, but by licensing and getting that residual income from other people using this technology. So what do you guys think? I mean, we get super excited talking about, um, you know, upcoming vehicles, things like that, but new technologies on how they make the vehicles, even if it, when, when it comes to paint, is still pretty cool in my opinion. So I will see you guys uh, in the next video. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe uh, for more Toyota and Lexus news, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.